Hi guys, Kim Bart here. We're talking about the power hour. The power! Woo! So, you know we need to put a little power into our business so that we can have a great next couple, three or four months. So, what is a power hour? It is setting aside time where you can use your time efficiently and effectively and get the most done because you're focused for a, a period of time. Belinda Ellsworth says the power hour should be broken up in 15 minute intervals of different things that you're going to call. So if you're in 15 minutes, you're calling friends, maybe 15 minutes, you're on Facebook messenger, 15 minutes, you're texting, 15 minutes, you're, um, I don't know, talking to people live, wherever you are. But anyways, the point is, is to take a set chunk of time. So your mission is to book as many home parties this month as possible. But first, you're inviting everybody to our opportunity event in a week. So you want to, one, ask them to the opportunity event. If they can't do that, two, um, invite them to have their own party. And then if they can't do that, three, invite them to your own party. So when are you going to talk to these people, these fine folks that need to see our books? Well, look over the week and decide, all right, this is 30 minutes here. I can work on it. This is 30 minutes here, or I'm going to take the kids on a walk and then I'm going to get them home and I'm going to have my husband watch them for an hour and I'm going to go lock myself in the, in the car or in the um, office and I'm going to work, 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 and I'm going to focus for one hour. Do nothing else but invite people for the time limit that you've set. If you can't afford a whole hour, do it in 15 minute chunks. I used to take my kids outside, we'd play, we'd be come in, ha have a snack, and then they'd watch a half an hour show. And that half an hour was while I was working. Maybe you have the baby in a bouncy seat, eating Cheerios right beside you. Whatever you need to do to make it happen. Because if you don't focus on inviting people and talking to people, you won't get to ask them. And now's the time because you have three great things to offer them. So you want to do that. You're going to try to invite 25 people one day, 25 people the next, and then if you really want to go for the bonus the next day talk to 25 more people but look at your calendar where are you going to put all these parties look at your calendar and try to find 10 different places in September why 10 well because we want to make sure we fill our calendar and we have lots of opportunities to talk to people and give away those free books but we know that some things will get canceled or moved around. And so we want to maximize our month now so that the next several months will be blasting off and super successful. So look at your calendar, get those dates, get your list of friends that you're going to be talking to, and then plan the time. And then focus. Don't answer Facebook messages. Don't text anybody unless it's about booking a party. Don't, don't do anything else for that a lot of time. Something that really helped me is I used to set an egg timer. Now I set my phone and I focus for that amount of time. That means if I need 15 minutes, 15 minutes, 15 minutes, and 15 minutes, I can set that throughout the day with alarms and I go make it happen. Maybe you need 30 minutes and 30 minutes. Maybe you just need a set hour. But guys, you can do this. Make it a priority. Focus, 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 because you want the power of you, bam, to be in your business. And you want the benefits to be lasting these whole next couple months. Because you know, if you work really hard now, it makes it easy the rest of the months because you'll book all your parties from those parties. Good luck. You can do it. Can't wait to hear the results.